Hi and welcome to Add More Zest with Diamonds. My name's Rebecca and I've got some items to share with you today from DIY Choose. They were kind enough to let me pick some items to show you all. So we'll start with the one that we can see. And this is another sort of off the canvas, as I like to call them, Christmas items. And they've got quite a few different designs of these, but I think they're really fun. So these are wine bottle bags. So you can give a diamond painting gift in a, well, I say a diamond painting gift. Wine goes with diamond painting, but you could put anything in this. So you could put a few diamond paintings in this, um, but it's nice to sort of showcase the art and have a little bit of extra special packaging. So maybe you've got somebody that is either hard to buy for or maybe all they ever want, you know, is a bottle of their special wine or the spirit that they drink. But you want to give them just that little bit more. Then these little bags are quite a nice way to do that because you put in time and effort in, aren't you? Uh, so we get a toolkit with a bag, with bags. And then these are the diamonds. We've got quite a few rhinestones by the looks of it and a couple of bigger ones. Oh, so it's a mixture of pearls and rhinestones. So we have yellow pearlies, red rhinestones, silver rhinestones, yellow rhinestones. You can tell the rhinestones because of the silver back. Then we've got oh three different shades of green for the rhinestones. We've got black, black ones purple ones, blue ones, and then in the sort of different shapes, we have a bigger red one. Then we have like a pearlized white one. And then we do have in here three little stars and we do actually only use one. So they give you three, but you only use one on this actual wine bag. And that goes at the tippy top of the Christmas tree. This one is a Christmas tree with a little dog and a little penguin. It's got a gingerbread man on it and all sorts. But there are loads of different designs that they do. Some of them a little bit um, less busy. But I just thought this one was fun. And that's a really nice, it's a nice bag. Draw string, no wrapping, always good. But yeah, fun. There are many, many more different things that I've seen come out for Christmas this year, more so than other years. So now's a nice time to start getting those in, uh, maybe getting some done for this year, maybe next year, if that's what it has to be. Stock up. Is that already open? No, it's not. It's just got the very, very sticky glue showing. Okay, let's get in number two. This is a thinner one. So this is, this is one of those paintings that looks like on the site, it looks like a quilling, but it is actually a diamond painting. So the picture on the website looks like it's quilling, but it's not. If you read the description, it is diamond painting. So this is 25 by 25 in size and it does come with 11 different diamonds. So can you see where it looks like a quill? But it's actually not. It is diamonds. And this one is a bursting bowl of fruit. And we have quite a few bigger style diamonds on this one. So we have some red, purple, green, you can see them. Then we have some big white pearls, some gold. Then we have what looks like AB coated white, nice bit of sparkle. And then we get into the rhinestones. So we have yellow, purple, orange, green, and red. Nice pops of color in that one which is always fun. 
and yeah just just a fun painting to do nice little possibly even one evening project maybe two depending on how much time you get to spend on it but that would look really nice framed in a kitchen just saying something to talk about something a little bit different I'm always thinking what room in the house can stuff go in and yes I do have a diamond painting in my kitchen just in case anybody's wondering it's not that one because I've only just got it but I do have a diamond painting in my kitchen and then last but by no means least we have the bigger one. Oh. I'm just reminding myself of what it was that I ordered. So this is 24 different colours and this is another abstract slash knot but look at the colours in that. It is a round and it is like an abstract clock but look at the colours. It's, it's like a watercolour effect behind the whole clock image. Oh, there is hardly any blocks of colour in this at all. So if you like confetti, this is a nice one. Does come with DMC numbers. So you can put them in with your spares easily. But look at that. Look, there's no there's hardly any big blocks of colour at all. There's a few that that's probably the biggest block of colour and I don't even think I'd call that a block I don't think it is um, it does come with a toolkit one of these days I'm going to forget to say it comes with a toolkit and somebody's going to ask me but oops. so a little bit more pastel-ish type colours but still some bright ones as well to make it pop that little bit but we have pinks greens that's a nice green a uh, nice pop of orange some darker colors but not many mainly done for shading look at all those gorgeous really nice purple got some more olivey green gray blues and blues another lot of vivid purple yellows burgundies pinks <gasps> very nice i do like that one that is pretty pretty stunning uh, size wise did i measure the size i don't think i did so it's down as a 60 by 40 um, my tape measure's got tangled up okay let's try that again <sighs> It is 50, uh, nearly 55 by 35. So you've got five centimeters taken off for like a two and a half centimeter border all the way around. And that is in a round. So I will pop links to all of these down below, of course. Uh, but we have a lovely watercolor clock. Again, another nice art piece. We've got some fruit, they look really good in your kitchen. And then we have a wine wine bottle holder, of which there's quite a few different designs. So if you do have those gifts that you want to send with a little bit more pizzazz, then go and check out um, the wine bottle covers. I will pop links to everything down below, of course. But thank you to DIY Choose for sending me these items um, that I can share with you all. Thank you for watching and I'll speak to you all again soon.